What's up guys, this is the Rifeman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as reunited as the United States. So, last time we successfully captured France and they really hate me, but I think they'll hate me a bit less when I knock down the universities because I don't need the research capacity because we're so far to the end of the tree. And what I have done is tactically taken some forts and positioned some stacks ready for the inevitable um, punch from the Prussians. What I'd like to do is generate some stacks in the United Kingdom to then do some amphibious ops in the rear so to attack Brandenburg or maybe Hanover something to stretch their resources because I'm fairly sure mine will be significantly more I'm significantly more able to withstand punches than they are two guards units, artillery, cavalry they got sharpshooters one unit of Marion's rangers so let's get a unit of let's get an actual unit of sharpshooters good Get some first rates built. Okay, so how's this going down here? Oh, still waiting for the Marathas to come out. If they move out from Paris, I'll make force them to attack Gibraltar. Ooh, should oh, I'm going to leave them for now. I'll let them do what they're doing. Let's hit end turn. See how the AI responds to the loss of Paris. The Barbary states are coming back in force, and so maybe I should have attacked them. In one turn I could knock the Barbary states out of the game, which might be a shout, because that's how I can make that stack disappear. Um, attack Tripoli. Attack uh, Tunisia. Is it Tunisia? Tunis. Whatever the city is named. Capture them both, knock them out of the game. Might be the cleanest way to do it. There we go. The Prussian hammer is coming. I need to really, really, really... Well, if I can get, get some fortifications built around Paris, that would go a long way. Yep, raid away. Raid away to your heart's content. What I need is a couple of good defensive wins. Oh, God. Yeah. They've sent that fleet to their death. Oh, God, to the Ottoman side of the Med. Brilliant. <laughs> I wonder if this will work out well. Hmm. They went down fighting. They took three ships and went down themselves. Say disaster. No, I'm not going to give you 44 grand to make peace. If anything, I'm going to land. Oh, dear. We all know where they're going. They're going to come say hello. And yeah, if I can open up a front with the Ottomans, that would be quite, quite good. See, so it might slow the campaign down quite, quite significantly, because I'll be fighting in North Africa and in Europe and in... Ooh, they're def they've... Why have you attacked me? You've got weak... Your infantry's damaged, you've got lots of cavalry, but cavalry's no good against late-game artillery, but I'll do it. And they do have lots of in, lots of um, rear covering their capital, so I can't even rely on, you know, beating this stack in the field capital. They're a northern, well, they're an Italian state, so they will have disproportionate amount of money and stacks. Well, see, it is disproportionate. Italian banking houses were a thing. Anyway, I'm being attacked, so feel free to attack. Garrison this warehouse? I can garrison this warehouse. Do I want to garrison this warehouse? As the United States, my advantage is in my sheer firepower. Three, four, five. Yeah, let's take my three, four, five. Yeah, let's pick a strong core of five. That's that unit I've already unlimbered. Set them there. 
Just need to cover the flanks, just have a ragtag bunch. Might send my sharpshooters into this into the warehouse. Let's get one unit of howitzers out on quick lime. Another battery of howitzers out on quick lime. Stronger cover on the right because they're a bit weaker. Weaker cover on the left because they're stronger. General in the centre. Bish bash bosh. Counter battery fire. See if I can remember how much of the harass I can knock out in the first volley. They got some of their gunners. Okay. So here come the tricky. Not the tricky part, but. Okay, how it is. Shrapnel shot, focus fire that carabiner, eight carabiners. They're focusing on my cavalry, so I'm going to spread them out. There you go, cast a shot. That's how he's making absolute. Oh, I was about to say making absolute pigs here of it, but look at that. Long riflemen, get them out, out into distance, and then have them deploy stakes. No. Yeah, they're trying to count battery fire. That's okay, once they've eradicated their cavalry. You need to focus fire that unit of provincial cav that's running right at you. Oh, fire. Oh, God. Oh, look at that. Oh, big clumps of troops. Devastating. Savoyard. The point we don't even need to worry about firing on their cavalry. Right, where's my lances? Send you out. No, oh, I can't really do a flanking run. They've got their cavalry too too well protected. Do some conventional targeting. They're gonna be a bit out, out, out in the uh, out in the weeds. Come on, your light infantry is supposed to be fast. There we go. Now the conventional battle begins. I always like watching the officer to see if he gets taken out. Oh, lost a unit of guns. That's okay. Get a unit of line infantry to plug the gap. Oh, the shot's coming in. Yeah, 
they are aiming at this house. So you must be cognizant of that fact. this flank up. Put pressure on their cavalry. God, they're being focus fired by three units. Must be minimum engagement distance. So fire at them instead? Nope. Round shot, turn off fire at will, turn on fire at will. Nope. Just looks like they're bugged. Ooh, so they've. How else has it taken an absolute. Alright, round shot. Fire on their field, how it's a regiment. Run my cavalry out around the flanks. Shrapnel shot, hit this unit of carabiners. Missed them. This this artillery unit is just terrible. Everyone get stuck in. Everyone. Oh, they've stopped, so my lancers are going to chew them up. Well, they should. Oh, I need to be very careful about how I... Oh. Isolated unit of carabiners. They're going to get some musket shots on me. Yep. Down to 69, blind the heavy cavalry. If I can be suitably devastating on the charge... I'm winning decisively, they are winning slightly. I want to go get within range of more of my troops. shot, focus fire their artillery. Everyone focus fire their artillery, even though my howitzers are out of range. Ah, oh, damn. That was a waste. Light infantry shouldn't get stuck in, but I've got my guards there to back them up if anything goes horribly wrong. Missed. Oh, 
I can mask them so need to mask them sufficiently quickly is to well charge one unit straight on, I suppose. Let's get my Lancer Guards on the go. Keep them in the fight. Lancer Guards, Lancer Guards, there you are. Turn off my artillery. Charge onto the guns. I need to ma I need to knock out as many units of these cannons as I can. Should have been a bit smarter with my general. If I can knock out this unit, that unit. Yeah, should be doable. So it's just those three there. One. Thirteen, or actually go for this eleven, because they're closer to the, the edge of the map. possibility where I get all of their artillery crews. That would be quite the coup. Three. That's the three of them there. Just the one. Just three left. Either way, this army needs to be retreated and replenished rapido. Excellent. Absolute rout. Oh god. Withdraw. <laughs> Yep, I was not gonna. I was not gonna fight another battle with that same depleted army. They need to replenish big time. Oh, oh no! The Spanish is coming through to the south. You know what? No, I was about to click yes, but then I realized I want Panama and Mexico and all of your colonies. <laughs> you almost got me. Ooh. <gasps> yes, Spain. Take the Italian stick. Take Venice. Rioting has broken out in this region as the lower Yeah, but I bet you're happy now, aren't you? Yes, you are. You Even taxing you. By lowering taxes or sending I don't think I do any of those. I think I'm going to build one of you. And I'm going to build... A church school and a smiths. Yeah, we need to replenish rapidly. Ooh, rocket troop, twenty-four pounder houses guard the core. I yield mines, seminary, knock you down. Empire. Oops, I have. Sorry for that, guys. I accidentally clicked off of the game. Um, actually, I might quickly check it's not ruined everything. So, just one second. Cool, radio. Um, nope, it didn't absolutely kill everything. And I've got about 10 minutes left. Aha! Troops being raised in England for the fight. You are going to be joined by them. 
you climb aboard your ships. Do I want to send a f one stack alone? Which is Prussia. Russia is my is at peace with everyone. There's a, a very knackered fleet. Let's have a look at who is Norway's a protector of Sweden, okay, so what about Denmark? Protector of Naples. Ally with Poland. Ah. Ready for <laughs> Keep an eye on you. You're under siege. Don't have walls though. Howitzers and the rubbish troops. What have you broken? Steam plow and cloth mill. Where's that? Pick fix clear a trading company. Let's build this. Okay, so let's send you east. Let's send you to attack Arthur Weber. Oh, it's really knackered anyway as an army. Let's just auto resolve that. But sometimes it's just not necessary to fight. Let's click. Let's click replenish again just to make sure that. Oh, click. Click. Oh, you're okay. Oh no, it's this army. Replenish. Let's go over down to Panama. Let's fight this one. Pause the end of the episode to see it off. They do have howitzers, so it'd be an aggressive one. They have cavalry, they'll be being aggressive too, like they'll have, they have actual heavy cavalry. Then, well, yeah, through all the gloom, I can see. Ah, oh, it's gone. Oh, they have. A, I did not see that. Right. Grand Battery Group. 12 pound a house, they get you up front to try target. Ha! They can target the, the mortars within the garrison. Excellent. So then off to the side. Let's group together my marines. Second New York. And all of my actual units of line infantry. As part of my breach securing teams, do that on units of long riflemen. With garrison, with my um, Philadelphia light cavalry on the flanks. How it says focus fire there, you focus fire. If I fire the mortars, then they'll hit the garrison cavalry anyway. Oof! Delicious. Let's have some more of that, please. Like, if I can weaken their cavalry before they run out and attack my assaulting troops, that would be excellent. That's what they've got. They've got colonial like cavalry, and they do have cuirassiers with their steel breastplates. And the mortars aren't firing. Um, no, don't want to miss the... There we go. It's perfect. To be honest, I could just move up. By the time I get... If I set them in to walk... Run one, walk one unit in to sit there and. Let's do two units. Because, yeah, these are going to be fairly knackered by the time they come in. Oh. Okay, maybe not walk them in. We're going to have to run them in. 
Let's get our Philadelphia Cav in a good position. Yeah, they are going to hit my assault forces. Ooh, check out their general. Yeah, I want my cavalry in to provide something to counter charge their cavalry when it comes out. And then my breach forces can move up. To be honest, they might even have to go into the fort. Come on, I need to get some more volleys of you off. Does quick climb? Is quick climb too short range? It is just. Yeah, this is it. Oh. Oh yes, look at that. Lovely. What I was concerned about was... I need to run these... There you go. They're going to come through this door. So I want to get them in position. And hit square. Get you in position. Hit square. There you go, as they charge out, they're going to be hit by two units forming square. Philadelphia Cav. Yeah, it says they're winning, but only because they're fighting dribs and drabs, because the marines are not paying attention to my plans. Let's get my long rifleman up on the top. The Secret Service long rifleman. Attack down the walls. Let's run this unit into the. There we go. Get my long rifleman up on the walls as well. Native bowmen are ready. Engage them. Engage them in combat. That's what we can do. Get these guys into the fort. Get these guys to charge the mortars. All they can do. No, don't you climb the walls. Just you wait here. If anything, wait for the mount riflemen to capture the walls. See, so guys, these guys have hatchets. Tom Hawk, sorry. This is valuable because they will shoot through this gap and attack the horse guards at the rear. There we go. So, the gate should... Yes, because the gate is now mine.
Not that it makes much odds anyway, because I'm about to win anyway. There you go, got my these guys are gonna charge the bowmen. Run out and charge the cuirassiers from the rear. Stunning victory. Nicaragua back, um, which is unfortunate. A nice, simple pirate battle would have been interesting. But Panama is ours. Let's capture it. Let's rebuild it. Let's replenish the troops. Let's upgrade the port. Let's see who's coming down. Just some. Cross here. You know, trigger clone on stuff. I'm not going to upgrade these because they're probably going to raid them anyway. To even give them roads. Excellent. Anyway, looking at the time, I think I'm at the end of this part. So, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.